Ladies and gentlemen, it is your lovely host here, it is Team Harai, and how are you doing on this Thursday's edition? I am doing very well. I do have social media accounts, and don't worry, sorry, don't worry, I'll discuss that after this part of the video is over. <clears throat> now, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and the subject, and of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. This one, there will be an article. Sorry, a link. Okay, it is now confirmed that Jeff Hardy will go to AEW once his non-compete clause will expire. That's good for him, okay? Dudley really dropped the ball with this whole Jeff Hardy um, incident, okay? They're an idiot, okay? He's gonna join forces, rejoin forces with his brother, um, Matt Hardy. And they're gonna probably tear their roof down or however. So, Dudley, you guys are flippant idiots uh, letting Jeff Hardy go to a better wrestling company. What's wrong with you, Dudley? What's wrong with you? I mean, I don't know. I just cannot really put my finger on it. And then when he was there, he was in a stupid storyline. So maybe you're better off of signing an, an, with a different company. And another thing is that we brag him to come back, begging him to come back. And they promise him to be in the Hall of Fame this year. And guess what? Jeff Hardy denied it. I don't blame him because all that BS that we put him through a couple of months ago. You guys and girls know by now what the hell happened. Jeff Hardy, we all know he had drug problems. Incidents, but I guess that was not the case. So that we assume he was on drugs at the live events. So they felt, they felt stupid. So... Because he did a drug test and it took forever to get the results back. And then I met Hardy's live stream on Twitch. They explained about this whole Jeff Hardy and he was clean as a whistle. So W just felt so stupid. Why did they put Jeff Hardy all through this um, stress? I don't know. They should never let him go in the first place. They should give him a proper storyline. Okay? Work well, Work with these young guys. You know, he don't need to win championships. He don't. But maybe he'll win championships in AEW. You know? Like I said before, that is W loss and that is AEW's gain. Look how many guys they got from W so far. It is amazing, you know? Wow. And I remember that, was it Corey Rhodes? Or someone says he's not going to sign all these guys who used to work for him. They seem like it, but to reach their own, I guess they changed their mind. But, you know, Will, do you think Jeff Hardy is going to make the right decision? Of working in with AEW or a bad decision. I think that is a right decision. Probably they offer him tons of money. You know, it's all about the money. They're not going to make this. He's not going to do this for free. You know? So, the in your tag team division is horrible. Okay, I'm sorry. You put one single guy and another single guy. And you decided to make him as a tag team. No, the Hardy Boys was a legit tag team. The Dully Boys was a legit tag team. Asian Krishna was a legit tag team. Um, who else? Um, uh, the, the Hart Foundation, there was a legit tag team. There's a lot of great tag teams back in the day. It was a legit tag team. Instead of put one single guy and another single guy, make them as a unit. No, W. You need to have a proper tag team division. 
But it seemed like my opinion is, of course, my opinion does not matter on social media. The tag team division is a laughing stock in the W. You know, McMahon is not really a big fan of the tag team for some stupid reason. He prefers solo guys, but everyone cannot get the major push. Oh yeah, even the Rockers was a great tag team, Legion of Doom. And but there's a lot of other great other tag teams that I don't want to discuss because they were horrible, you know, you know. But that's what I want to say. So McMahon was never a fan of the tag team division at all. I mean, I mean that's what I heard. I was actually true or untrue. He liked these super heavyweights like Hulk Hogan, Batista. The list goes on and on. He likes those kind of guys. So, whatever is going to happen with Jeff Hardy in AEW, I wish him a lot of luck. He's going to win a lot of championships. Probably a lot of great feuds. Maybe he's going to reunite the feud with CM Punk. You remember that feud back in 08, 09? I wish that happened that way, but it never happened. So, hopefully that will happen in that feud. You never know. Maybe CM Punk would be the heel. And then... Jeff Hardy would be the face. I think they could use that name because Jeff Hardy and Matt Hardy, that's their real names. W does not own that. So, does not look good for W. You dropped the ball, W. Way to go. And this won't be the first time that they, they let go great talent. But another wrestling company will use them in the, the right way. Okay, everyone. Now you follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. Double click the link. DM me. Do you know I can make arrangements for our future episode? Have a good one and enjoy your day. And I'll see you guys tonight. Later, Gators.